This is an anonymous message from the United States Liberation Front to its leaders and supporters around the world. With a great sadness, many of our citizens have realized that our government has lost control of its way. As formerly stated by our founding father Thomas Jefferson, government, even in its best state, is but a necessary evil. Our government should exist solely to serve its people and for no other reason. However, for the last century, his American dream has fallen short of reality. In fact, our government has become little more than a privatized institution. We demand that this be changed. We demand utter transparency and proper representation in our government. We are not the final boss of the internet but the final boss of humanity itself, and we are prepared for a difficult and lengthy battle. However, as Martin Luther King Jr. wisely wrote, it is an irrational notion that there is something in the very flow of time that will cure all ills. As such, we therefore seek to use our time constructively and take action by openly declaring war on the United States government. Our war will not be one of violence, nor will it be anti-American or involve physical physical destruction of any kind on the government or its numerous buildings. Despite this fact, our battle will not be carried out through DOS attack or other child shit. This is to be a conclusive war, and it will be one of absolute civil disobedience and resistance carried out for our people and for our nation. We seek to destroy our current government's foreign and domestic policies and to establish a priority list in which the people are at the top of the page for the first time since the late 1800s. We seek to pluck the weeds from the gardens of capitalism and to give life back to the cauliflower and sage, to save capitalism from its capitalists. We urge all those listening to participate in our endeavor by practicing peaceful civil disobedience and openly supporting our cause. Singers, artists and writers, be creative and spread our message. Speakers be demonstrative. Shout at the top of your lungs until your brothers and sisters hear our call. And vote for those who already have such as Ron Paul. Operation Counterbalance, engaged. To the United States government, the enemy of what you represent is no longer that of the 99%, but of the entire human race known colloquially as anonymous. The people should never fear the government, the government should fear the people. We are the people. We are the only system. We are the faces of the past and the promise of the future. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. We're here to set you free.